We're in the fourth phase of the Under-20 Pirates Cup and I think what has kept it going uh, so long over the years is that from the very, very first one that we held in 2016, uh, the follow-through has just been fantastic. You know, we've been able to, to promote players to our senior team, uh, the likes of Augustine Mashlonoko, the likes of Lyle Foster, uh, Yusuf Mart, all of these guys came through uh, playing in the, in, the, in the Pirates Cup and obviously what's also exciting about it is the, is the next phase where uh, we take guys across to, to to a trip overseas as part of Project X and that also just amplifies what we're doing here with the Pirates Cup and also gives them an opportunity to, to showcase themselves um, against some of the best under 20, under 21 and in some instances under 23 talents in the world. In my opinion it opens a lot of doors for most teams and young, young stars because they don't get the opportunity to play against big clubs because they're often not in the league but then this tournament creates like those for them to be seen by other coaches and other teams. When you try to identify players, the most important part of it is, is are these players regular football players? In the sense that, do they participate in regular league matches uh, week in, week out? And, and you can see with the caliber of, of, of teams that, that, that are here, a structured way of playing, um, structured way of coaching, very, very respectable coaches that are here and, and respectable teams. So, uh, a fantastic initiative and I think it's, uh, it's probably the right uh, sort of blueprint uh, in terms of scouting and, 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 and for this country moving forward. It's very important because it, it plays a huge role in the future of the country, not only of the club. It's, it's a great initiative, not only giving the opportunity of young boys, uh, the under 20 of Orlando Pirates, but it's, it widens the opportunity for each and every other boys to break in as well because the scouts, they can be picked up. So it's, it's a proper development structure for the youth. Yeah, I think uh, as a club, as a, uh, a big club like Pirates, you know, it's, it's very important to, to, to invest in, in, in young stars, you know, um, the, the upcoming ones, you know. Um, I think South Africa as well, uh, they, they're going to um, show interest in this uh, young, young, young talent and I think they, they're going to help the country. It's good to, to develop players. If you can look at a team like, um, sort of example, Barcelona, you know, most of their, their, you know, their players, they come from development. Same like, you know, Pirates, you know. There's way we're doing good, you know, because of like plus all the development, you know. South Africa have got like talent. Um, I've watched some of, you know, the few games. I think, you know, most of the players were so impressive. Obviously, you know, Pirate is a big team and most of their players, you know, they used to watch, you know, uh, their team. That's why I think they're playing same as their team, you know, it's like they always go and watch their training or watch their games, you know. I was so impressed by most of, of the players and hope in future they'll be, they'll be playing for, for, for the first team. joyful experience. Um, I was given objectives by the coaches before the tournament and well, one main objective was to be the best striker in this tournament and score the most goals and I'm very grateful to God that he gave me the strength to achieve that objective because from the coach's side he's very happy with the performance that I gave out in this tournament. I didn't do it all by myself. It was the help of my teammates, the coaches, the staff, everybody that was with me before the tournament, then during the tournament. So it's very special. That's why I managed to score the most goals. Oh, an amazing tournament. Lots and lots of football, which is really important for the boys at this stage. Um, so yeah, lots of minutes under the belt. Uh, challenging, very challenging. There were some good teams this year, uh, which made it challenging, which is yeah, good, but uh, yeah, lots of minutes, very happy, great experience.